Bath and Body Works by three, get three free. Basically end up 20 bucks each. I jumped on it, bought six of them. Opened two of them so far, it's two for two. Awesome fragrance. This is the third one, I'm kind of worried though. If they cannot hit a, a perfect score, right? So out of the six bottle, I do not expect everything to be great. But um, crossing my finger, this is Whiskey Reserved. I kind of smelled it when I did the short unboxing. So first impression, here we go. I gotta hold down my expectation, but the bottle itself is the same in everything. The cap is very, very snug. Anonymizer works well. Right, spray time. Let's see if we could um, do this. All right, okay, just for good measure. There we go. Just a little clicking. This one is not as good as the other one, but like I said, can I expect to hit everything perfect? Ah, uh, okay. Yeah, the streak might be over. Two good ones, and the third one is um, it's very apparent what they're going for. Very, very apparent. Um, this is a a inspired or clone of Paco Rabanne Invictus or Invictus Agua. Okay, that version. I think it's the Agua because I'm smelling the marine notes, that sea type of vibe. Not necessarily the ocean, not necessarily the salt, but mainly the marine vibe without the heavy salt. Yeah, that's what they're going for. Um, maybe not exactly, but you know what? I also have... Well, welcome to my place. My name is Dave. Just hanging out, chatting about fragrance, but I'm actually disappointed. Do you know what? Like I said, you know, I have um, Invictus Aqua, 2018 version. I do not like that one much. I also have Mont Blanc Legend Spirit, which is actually better than the Paco Rabanne. I enjoy that one better. So, and I think this one is closer to that, the, the Legend Spirit. The little white bottle, I have it in the box. I, I, the thing is I have so many boxes and um, put it away at different places. It's hard to dig up all of them, so I do apologize. If I have it, I'll grab it, but I, I can't get to it uh, easily. So, yeah, this is close to the Mont Blanc Legend Spirit, which is very similar to Aqua Paco Rabanne Invictus Aqua 2018 version. Okay, I never smelled the 16, but I heard it's much better than the 18. So, I think it was 16. Yeah, the marine notes is um, coming across. Now, uh, a thought just hit me. I was almost going to say, what are they doing, the bath and body? What, what are they doing? Copying it, um, you know, a, a DNA that's been copied every by everyone. Then I realized, you know, I thought, okay, it makes sense. I have ocean and also I have white water. Both are different than this. The ocean does have the ocean vibe. The white water has the white water vibe. The, they're just missing the sweet bubblegum, uh, marine citrusy type of vibe, just like Invictus Aqua, which is now they have their own version. Now the name does puzzle me. Why are you calling it Whiskey Reserve so far fetched or far different than the Aqua, the obvious Aqua vibe this is uh, portraying across do you know what hmm. this is funny the I'm, I'm getting right now okay i'm getting marine vibe but then when i'm looking at the name whiskey reserve do you know what <laughs> the marine vibe could be mistaken adding with the the blast of the alcohol on top it does give me a, a just a tiny bit of whiskey now i'm stretching it i'm just I'm just, you know, uh, I'm just trying to grab a straw or something. I mean, what, what is the expression where I'm just uh, grabbing a hair by the hair, meaning it's not really it's really whiskey. I don't get the booziness of it, out of it. I'm getting the mainly the, the blue, you know, oceany vibe without the salt or I just call it marine vibe. Yeah, I'm just talking all over the place because I'm quite disappointed that they, they're going in that direction with this one. I was hoping for some sort of booziness, right? Reserve. It feels like, you know, a very well-aged. Oh, it sounds like very well-aged 
uh, whiskey or something. But I don't, I don't get any alcohol in here. I mean, or booziness. I do get some sort of, you know, citrus, maybe the violet leaf. Yeah, the marine vibe is very, very strong. Maybe just a, a bit of cedar wood. Just if you ever try and bake yourself or, or a Mont Blanc Legion spirit, it basically is like that. It might not be a one to one clone, but it's, you know, you cannot mistake in this for anything else but those two. Um, oh man, this. Yeah, I mean, my, my bad for talking about two for two so far. Now, this one is. If you have any of those, don't, don't even bother right away yeah don't bother if you um but if you don't have those um Bhagavad and or the Mont Blanc religion spirit if you don't have those and you're looking for some that is um suitable for the warm weather that is very easy going i say that a lot a lot of fragrances are very easy going the house of bath and body works i'm you know their bread and butter is making something that people would enjoy they would buy a lot and uh, you know they can sell it for cheap for 20 bucks is okay i'm not mad at it but if you're gonna spend 40 bucks might still be okay this one is smelling nice yeah it's not transitioning yet to much of anything else so whatever the notes i told you is still sticking around but it does projecting it does project yeah this one is a nice projector at least for now it's been what five minutes it's still here the, the, the fresh cedar, the citrus are here. The citrus probably lemon or bergamot. Yeah, something like that. Violet leaves, the usual stuff. Yeah, this... <laughs> Man, if you've been around the fragrance hobby long enough and you do a lot of blind buy like I do, you're gonna fall into um, the you know Invictus DNA or the um, Creative Ventus DNA sooner or later all right those are two extremely popular dna that people copy it seems like every fragrance house has their own version or a direct copy okay they're not shy about it so yeah this is one of those um but if you don't have it 20 bucks is a great deal though so the quality is good though don't don't get me wrong it's a nice uh, scent I would say though, I still think the Legend Spirit from what I recall is better than this. So I would just quickly rank this as uh, in Mont Blanc, Legend Spirit, the number one. This will be number two. And then the much hated by me, Paco Rabanne, <laughs> uh, Invitus Aqua, number three. That one I just hate. It has a bug spray type of vibe to it. I just can't stand it. Cannot stand it. But this one is, is, is okay, it's, it's nice in the slot number two. Uh, but for 20 bucks, I cannot hate it. It's very good quality for the $20. It's very versatile. For sure, it's going to be for the youngins, um, you know, teenagers, you know, what, 18, 16, 14, 12. Yeah, you can wear this. Any age is fine. Yeah, uh, maybe... Be, you know, the teenager up to 30, 30, 40. If you're a little bit older than that, a little bit more mature than that, yeah, you're going to think this is too youthful. There's a sweetness in the background to it. The sweet is about 3 or 4 out of 10. It's not super sweet, but the citrus and the marine vibe give it a very refreshing, very uh, a sweet tinge to it from those few um, notes. Yeah, so... Yeah, I don't know if I could keep dragging out too long. It basically, it's an Invictus one. I'm just talking to the people that don't have experience with those two that I mentioned. Uh, it does lean unisex. I can see ladies wearing this. There's nothing masculine about this, even though it says Whiskey Reserve. You know, I hate it when the name is misleading. I don't know what they're thinking. Did they put it in the wrong bottle? Okay, maybe I have the wrong bottle. If you have this one and you smell something totally different, please let me know. <laughs> Did it put in one bottle of whiskey reserve? I'll probably live with it. Since I bought it, I don't want to throw it away. So I'll live with it to see if it changes to risk whiskey somehow, some way. Okay. Um it is very versatile, you can wear anywhere, any occasion, to school, to work, 
it's not overly sweet. So if you were to meetings and things like that, you will not smell too out of place. It should be okay. All right. Um, yeah, I don't want to drag it way too long. This is been there, done that. I'm not sure what they're doing, but I'm right, sorry to sound so down because I'm kind of, I was hoping for some boozy tinge, uh, boozy. Yeah, uh, this is a little, but anyhow, it's a nice one for what it is. Okay. I hope that is helpful. If you, now the reason I'm going through this because, um, end of the year, they might have more sale. Or if you see by three, get three, you're thinking about it. Since you have to get six bottles to so get that $20 great deal, you know, you might still be interested for the rest. So I'll still have, um, what, three more bottles from the six. And then after that, I'll probably rank my uh, top of the brand, right? What I have so far, but a few more to go. So if you're interested, stick around. Okay. Uh, with that said, I hope that is helpful. See you next time.